It's Booty Quake here from Roller Derby Athletics. Today I have a lower body strength and endurance workout for you. Today's workout is an AMRAP challenge. That means as many rounds as possible. I'm going to give you three compound moves that are going to work your entire body, your lungs, and especially your legs. We're going to have a set number of reps for each of those moves, and we're going to see how many rounds of those we can get through in the allotted time, which is 12 minutes. You're going to have to work hard for those whole 12 minutes while trying to maintain good form. This kind of workout is what you need to give you that extra gas in the tank at the end of a jam. So before we get started, I'm going to go through the technique for each of the three compound movements so we can get our form correct. Okay, so our first move is a lunge jump with a walkout push-up. So we're going to do three lunge switch jumps like this. One, two, three. Pick up your back foot and walk yourself out to a one leg push up. Walk yourself back, put the same foot back, and three more lunge jumps. Back to your next walk out push up. So we're going to do 10 reps of this. The next one is burpees with a flying plank. It's going to look like this do a burpee to a plank. Then lift opposite arm and opposite leg, and that's one rep. We're going to do 10 reps of that one as well. Our final exercise of the three is a side lunge jump with a leg lift. So it looks like this. Get yourself into a skater position, do a big hop to switch sides, hop, hop three times, lift that side leg, that's one rep. Hop, hop, hop side lift. We're going to do 20 of these and make sure when you do this one that you're not just staying low but you're doing a big hop to switch. So those are the three exercises. Again, 10 reps, 10 reps, 20 reps. See how many rounds you can do keeping good form in 12 minutes. Right, so make sure that you warm up before you get started. Set a timer for 12 minutes to count down. Here we go. Side jumps. Okay, that was round one. We're gonna go for round two. at the end of round two. Okay, that was it. I got two full rounds and up to three burpees done. I'm going to catch my breath, get some water, and then we'll chat. Okay, so I've caught my breath enough to tell you that that workout was definitely tough, I'm not going to lie. 
but it's going to be a great one to do now, record your score, and then come back to you in a couple of months and see how your fitness has improved by sticking with these workouts. So what I want you to do is write down your score and share it in the comments and let me know how you did. Now, if you noticed watching the video, even though it was tough, instead of racing through it with poor form just to get a good number, I stopped, slowed down, took breaks when I had to. I really had to slow down on those side lunge jumps to get good form. So I hope you'll do the same. Try to maintain optimal form rather than racing through with poor form. You'll get more out of it doing it the better way. So I really hope that you try this workout and if you like it, share it with a teammate and help them become a better athlete too. One more thing, I really want you to check out the blog post on this one because I'm gonna write up some modifications that you can do in case some of these moves are too challenging for you. So check it out at rollerderbyathletics.com. Till next time, I'm Booty Quake. I just kicked your ass. Now you can go kick somebody else's. Bye for now.